Gossip. It's your girl Jonesy, and I have some special guests. Ugh, yes, I said guests in the studio with me today. One happens to be my twin neck. <laughs> Cheryl Keith, have jokes. Make sure you <laughs> I got Jackie Christie and her husband Doug Christie in the studio with me today. What's up, guys? Hey, how what's are happening? You? How you doing? Fantastic. Can you believe it? They always talk about our neck. I know, isn't that something? Haters. I don't even care. I like. Hey. I like that now. Congratulate. See? I'm that next step good. Out the studio. <laughs> <laughs> so, how y'all doing today? We're doing fantastic. Doing good? Yes. Okay, so how are you enjoying this LA weather? It's hot right now, right? Yeah, we, we just actually came from Seattle. It was a little rainy, but now it's, it's nice and hot. We're enjoying it. Yeah. Okay, oh, all right. Yeah. So, let's speak of, about Seattle real quick. I know your mother passed. I'm so sorry about that. How are you dealing with all that? I'm doing okay. I have good days and bad days, but you know, most of the time I know that she's at peace, so I just pray about it whenever I start having it down. So, let's get to talking about basketball wise. Right now, you guys are like halfway through the season, right? Halfway. I'm not even talking to you yet. I know. Yes. <laughs> let's yes. talk about this. What are, you, what are your first thoughts the first episode you saw and you said, you saw Jackie say, well, who the f are you? <laughs> well, I, I know that that's my wife. I know how she gets down. I love her to death, and uh, I'm proud and excited for her. When they when they called and it was a possibility that she could do it, I was like, yes, go ahead and do it. I, I think it's going to be wonderful, and, and it has been. Well, you guys just got married for the 16th time, sweet yeah. 16. Yeah. yeah. How was it? Awesome. Yeah, it what was fantastic. It was <laughs> Vegas. I mean, right. hey, Vegas. The girls were there, so we got to experience it with the girls. Except Drea. Doug's friends. Yeah, Drea yeah. wasn't there, and that was disappointing, because I really did want her to come. I right. did, and I think that as time went on, she realized that. And I think some miscommunication somewhere in there, I don't know, I ain't saying no names, Malaysia, <laughs> excuse me, <laughs> um, might have said That's something, funny. and um, you know, so, but it's all good. I love the girls. And let's talk about your bachelorette party yeah. that you just had on TV. Yeah. Doug, what'd you think about that? I, I wasn't there, so I saw it with everybody <laughs> else, and I was like, well. Yeah. I wasn't really shocked. Did you yeah. get your gift from Drea? Actually, it's in our closet. Yeah, we. We actually are going to use it some. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. I like that. Oh, wait a minute. Well, let's talk about your relationship with Drea. Yeah. And I also want to know, like, when you heard Drea was a former dancer, what were your thoughts about that? Like, your wife hanging out with a. Show. Yeah. You know, I, I don't really judge people, so it doesn't, it, you know, it doesn't really matter. I, my wife is, I know, very mentally strong, so none of that is not going to rub off. You know, she's just a person. She's doing her thing. We understand. It's, it's no big deal. And my, my feelings with Drea is I, my best friend, you know, used to dance. And so I have, and my family members are colorful. All of us are. We all come from not a perfect background. So I was really surprised when a lot of people were like, oh, my God, she's judging. And she's just, when I'm the main one on the show saying I don't judge. On to a more serious note, when you guys found out about the police report mm -hmm. and you and Laura were sitting there Googling, mm -hmm. the police report that you found, was that all you guys found or did you um, actually, you know, make a couple phone calls, send a couple <laughs> text messages, <laughs> and, like really find out? Because everything on the internet, you know, yeah. is not true. And that's what I was telling Andrea tonight. She was crying on episode five or six, I think it was. I was saying, I go through the same thing. There's a bunch of garbage on the internet about me too. Lies, misconstrued things. Tell us what happened from your own point of view, from your words, right. because you're saying it didn't happen, it didn't happen, but the subject keeps coming up in all the groups, you know? Right. So as the editors have to bring it to that moment, you're missing all the parts that got up to it, right. so tell us. Okay, well, yeah, because in the last episode, you kind of turned it around. Dre is like, like your friend, almost like your BFF at that point. And then the next thing you know, it's like, you start talking about Laura. No, it's not even like that. I'm just a realist. I am CJ. No, I'm telling you what I saw. What? You were like, <laughs> I heard someone has been talking about Oh, her. yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the third, and here she comes. Hey, girl. <laughs> oh, yeah, and see, that is what kills me because it's like, I really want, we were at her charity event, and I right. really wanted to be respectful. All right, so last but not least. You played for 14 years. Mm -hmm. Now playing, and now you're retired. What is it like for you every day now, just to wake up and just completely enjoy the full of life? It's uh, <laughs> it's fantastic actually, because I homeschool my son. So every day oh, wow. we wake up and we we grind and we do our school and we have a good time. And then I train athletes, so he's one of them. So I train him, and he's kind of my guinea pig. We always got something happening. All right, you guys. Well, that's it for today with my interview with Jackie and Doug. We had a lot of fun. So make sure you tune in every Monday at eight o'clock to watch Basketball Wives LA. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thank you. 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 Th
The reunion show is about to take next week in LA and moi will be there just like I was at the last one. And I will let you know in all the good stuff that happened that they don't show on TV when they take it, all right? So make sure you log in to Boston.com for all your entertainment and celebrity gossip news because we do it like no other and we do it and we do it because we do it.